Hello, ghostlings. It's your friendly neighborhood medium. Welcome you back to Afternoon with the Medium. Today we'll be starting a little new series, sort of. It's still Afternoon with the Medium, of course. But I thought something a little more fun could happen here. Because you know I'm great at explaining things indirectly. I'm great at confusing the point, making the point, and then forgetting the point. You know how it is, being a medium with a blanket. You know how, you get it. You've seen the mediums on the show, they go, This is demon, no, it's ghost. Demon, ghost, demon, ghost, demon, ghost, demon, ghost. Which is it? We'll never know. Because they don't know themselves, they're just making stuff up. Anyway. New series idea. So, I bought this little bookie book. The little book. It's called, um... It's called Mythical Monsters. Oh, this is a scary book, sort of. It's ages 7 and up, and as you know, the medium is at least above 7, if not a little older. So, um, yes, we will be doing this. I will, there are some monsters in here. Let me demonstrate. Let me, let me give you an example. There's the boogeyman, there's the Loch Ness monster, there's a troll, there's a mummy. Not your mummy, like, good morning mummy, more like, I'm gonna eat you, that kind of mummy. Or the, you stole my, you stole my cookie. Oh, that could be the mummy. Oh well, you know, the, the the ones in the grave that look ugly, that could also be any mom, oh. You know, the ones with old dry skin. Oh, that could still be both of them. Um, sorry mom. Anyway, there's a golem, chupacabra, so I thought, what if, what if I tried to explain some creatures to you? So, we're going to be doing that, we're going to be explaining some monsters to you. The first monster we'll be looking at today, skippity skip skip, is, uh, look at this one, it's the black dog. Look how scary it is. So, the black dog, basic myth, let me tell you. So, you know, historically speaking, people see the dogs. They see, they tend to be black dogs, which I think we should expand our horizons and not just have black dogs, have different colored dogs. We should have, instead of have a big dog like that, we should have a little chihuahua. Little Chihuahua dog with blazing hellfire eyes that goes rough rough. You're gonna die. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the main point of this myth. It's a ghost dog that walks around with its dog legs or paws like this. They walk, and if you see him, it means you're gonna die. Which it, it's kind of not. That's not a nice story. But so imagine you're walking around. You're like. Ooh, this is this is mostly Germany. Oh, I think it's in Canada too. Any of my Canadians out there? You're lucky. You'll get to meet the dog. Let's see. Britain, Ireland, Scandinavia. Oh, and Nova Scotia. If you live in Nova Scotia, beware the black dog. Anyway, so you're walking around. You're just listening to some I don't know Grease Two soundtrack or something. You're just walking around and you see Doo -doo, a black dog. He looks at you with demon eyes and goes, Rrr. They're like, hi, doggy. You give the dog a pet. And the dog's like, what? What's going on? Oh, okay. This is kind of nice, actually. Oh, the dog is calm. He's fat, relaxed. Good doggy. And you go on your way and then bam, hit by a car. See, that's the kind of story this, this doggy do. He made doggy doo doo. <laughs> anyway, so he, he, that's what he does. He, he makes you see your own... He warns you of your death. So is he bad? Is he good? I don't know. Do you want to die? Probably not. So he would be bad to you. You know what I mean? Like, he, it's not as bad. You know, it is it is ghost. But the problem is, it's ghost dog. Yes, it's not a real dog. It's not dog you'd see your neighbor walking. Your neighbor who doesn't shut up and whistles. It's not a dog you like that. It's a doggy that goes poof poof. It's gone. Like this. So imagine you're walking. You're walking. Poof, poof, it's gone. Poof, poof, gone. And let me tell you about ghost dogs. Ghost dogs are a pain. They are an absolute pain. You know how dogs can see ghosts? Ghost dogs can see ghosts and dogs. They can see everything. That's not fair. That's cheating. And you know the annoying thing about some annoying things about dogs? You know they whimper like that's how they whimper. Or they scratch at your door, they say, please let me in, because I'm lonely. Imagine a ghost dog. He does that all the time, and he does it on Mondays, because he's a ghost. He does it every time, every ghosting Monday. He does it. He scratches at the door, and you're like, you're a ghost, you can walk through the door. And he's like, I know, but this is funnier. Also, ghost dogs can talk. They have secret language. They go, depending on how the jowls move. Yes? No. Hooray! Watch the jowls on your dog, you know what I'm saying. 
You know what I'm saying? But imagine Ghost Dog. He can make more jowls because he's Ghost. Yes, that is that is the Black Dog. Any other factoid I can give you about Ghost Dog? You have a chill before it appears, which is typical of all ghosts. So Black Dog, you're, you're not very that. You're not your original. You're just like any other ghost. Uh, Vikings. Oh, Vikings. Those guys. I miss them. I miss them. Oh, in Missouri, you asked, Hunter threw an axe and an enormous black dog. It passed to its ghostly body. Well, obviously, it's a ghost. People don't understand ghosts. That's why I'm here to explain ghosts. People don't get it. If they got it, this life would be easier, man. They'd be so much easier. So, yeah, that's the black dog. Friendly. Myth explained. Black dog explained. They scary. They let you know that you're gonna die. I guess they kind of like banshees, aren't they? What is up? What is up with the uh, Ireland and the British with the the cring the things that are ghosts that scare you when you die, like banshees? What the heck, England? That was this afternoon with the medium. I hope you enjoyed me explaining the black dog. Um, look how friendly he is. When do you want to give him a nice pet? Look at his little snout. <laughs> Anyway, so that was my discussion on the black dog. I hope you feel more informed about the black dog myth. And if you encounter a black dog, remember, just pet it. And prepare for death. Or to regular dog. Look for the eyes. If, they, if they're burning like this, don't pet. Say bye-bye. If, as always, if you have any questions, feel free to ask me in the comments. Uh, Save the music. I got your apology. I forgive you now. Admittedly, I rewatched the ad and it was not great, but uh, I would like to improve upon it. So if you have more tips, feel free to comment. Thank you, Frog, um, for all your comments. Uh, but I am right. Even if you called it fun day, Monday would still be the prime ghost day. And what is the other thing? Oh, yeah, cats are perfect in soup. They add so much flavor. Mm. Anyway, that's all for this episode. And remember, if you see a ghost, don't say hi. Oh, burp. Excuse me. Pardon me. I got a little excited there. <clears throat> anyway, if you see a ghost, don't say hi. Say bye-bye.